Developing tonight, police say a husband beat his wife to death with a baseball bat. The couple's child making the desperate call to police. Well, this tragedy right now unfolding near Sahara and Fort Apache. That is where we find 13 Action News anchor Carla Wade tonight with the very latest on this very disturbing story here, Carla. Yeah, Todd and Trisha police are still trying to piece together exactly what happened after getting that frantic 911 call from a teenager saying that his mother had been beaten to death. That call coming from a gas station near Fort Apache in Sahara. That is where officers picked up the teen who directed them to an apartment complex where officers were able to get in the apartment through an open window. There they found a 30 year old woman on the bed with an apparent head wound. In the same room, a man in his late 30s believed to be that woman's husband. Also in the room, a baseball bat. I stress anybody going through any kind of domestic violence type situation, there are a lot of community resources out there. All someone has to do is reach out to one of those agencies and there's free services where people can receive help. So we're not out here discussing such a tragic incident. Now, police immediately took that man into custody. They say that that woman died of her injuries at UMC. They also say that they responded to another domestic disturbance involving that couple, but at a different address. Reporting live, Carla Wade, 13 Action News. Carla, sad story. Thank you. We will stay on top of this story throughout the newscast tonight. You can always get the latest by visiting our website at KTNB.com.